told you I wasn't crazy. <laughs> I saw that thing. So Miss Danville, Laura Jones, is now this year's Miss Kentucky 2016. She went up against 29 other contestants this past Saturday to earn the crown. And she joins us with more on her new title and plans for the upcoming <laughs> year. Welcome. Thank you. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you for having me. Have you been able to exhale yet? Not quite. Uh, this is, let's see, day three. I was crowned on Saturday and today is what, Monday, Monday Tuesday? Oh say, gosh, yeah. so maybe only day four, I don't know. But, um, but yeah, it's been a whirlwind so far. So trying to just exhale. Have and you, have you been able to, to see your reaction to the crowning moment yet and your thoughts yes. on the way you behaved? Yes, <laughs> <laughs> I've only watched it about 1700 times. <laughs> um, it's, it's a whirlwind when you're up there, you don't really, it, nothing, is clear in your mind when they announce your name they announce the first runner up and so it's it can be confusing mm -hmm. um, but watching it back I remember it. it it all comes back when you watch the video yeah, yeah. so <laughs> I guess now what's next for you um, I guess on the road to Miss America yeah well right now I'm um, just preparing for Miss America doing the you know we have talent and interview on stage questions mm -hmm. swimsuit evening gowns so preparing all those phases of competition Miss America is September 11th uh, so that's coming up quick, but mm -hmm. also the job of Miss Kentucky is about a lot more than that. So it's promoting uh, Children's Miracle Network, which is Miss America's national platform. It's promoting Kentucky Proud and working with the Kentucky Department of Agriculture. So I'm doing a little bit of that as I'm preparing for Miss America as well. What was your platform? My personal platform is called WAIT, it stands for What Am I Thinking, and it's basically speaking out about eating disorders. So it was motivated by a personal experience of mine. I struggled with an eating disorder about five years ago, and um, it's just something that's very near and dear to my heart, and I'm passionate about mentoring young girls through uh, that dark time in their lives and, and being there for them, providing resources for them to get the healing and treatment they need. And that's it's awesome. interesting because your job essentially is going to be going to these schools yes. for the next okay. year. Yes depending on what happens with Miss America. But right. nonetheless, that's your initiative now is to talk so you'll have access to a lot absolutely. of young people. Yes, absolutely. And even if I were to win Miss America, that would still be my job sure. is, is being that role model and being that mentor for young children and, and really people of all ages. So yeah, that's, that's the job of, of any title holder is to be that role model and I'm really looking forward to it. So is this something that you've wanted to do since you were a little girl or is this just something you said, eh, this might be a great way to get some scholarship money? Originally, I, I did start competing when I was 13, okay. and I was involved in the teen program of Miss America. So I competed in the teen program for four years and then in the Miss program, and I just won my fourth year. Mm -hmm. So originally, yes, it was to get some scholarship money for school, and I was introduced to this program by a close friend who was involved. Mm -hmm. And But, you know, it became so much more than that very quickly. It became a, a message and a, a platform for me to voice um, my message and my story and, and use my story to encourage others too. So it became a lot more than just scholarship money, but right. originally it did start out as that. Yep. And she's got that good looking tiara on top <laughs> of her head. <laughs> Laura's going to head to Atlantic City, New Jersey to compete in the 2017 Miss America competition on September the 11th. And to learn more, log on to MissAmerica.org and you can find out more information on Miss Kentucky. Log on to MissKentuckyPageant.com. That's awesome. All the Congratulations. Best you, yeah. Thank yeah. you so much. All Thank right. you for having me. Well, well, the weather it's was crazy. not very good for the 4th of July. No, Tom Ackerman, after yes, all those beautiful days.